That was the strike. Hi there everyone, welcome to another video. The tailor-made P790s are such amazing clubs and they have got such a great reputation and I've tried them a couple of times in the past but I've managed to pick up this fantastic brand new, I mean I've hit it a few times now so not so brand new, but only a few times, brand new P797i. It's a, it's a demo club so it's got kind of the, the screw in the top but it's one degree upright, two degree flat option so I've got it in one degree upright, that's how I normally have my irons anyway. It's a stiff graphite shaft, it's a very nice graphite shaft actually, a UST Mamiyama recoil. And I'm just going to review this and tell you what it feels like, give you some numbers and hopefully enlighten you as to whether or not you should give these a try at your local golf shop um, or golf course. And what I'm going to do as well, stay to the end because I'm actually going to give you an opportunity to win this club. I mean, I, I just bought it because I was interested to see what they're like. Um, I'm going to give you a chance to win this club to so stay to the end and you can find out how you can win yourself this club. I will ship it to you and uh, yeah, you can be in a chance to win it. So let's let's have a look then. 7-iron. Let's bring the green in. I'll put the green at 190. I normally hit 7-iron kind of around 185-ish, 190. This is quite strong lofted. I think it's about 30 degrees. I'll just hit a few shots of it to tell you what the feel's like. All that good stuff. Little bit pulley, bit short on the landing. That's okay though. Now, obviously, it's got the same old usual stuff. It's got the tungsten weight in the bottom. It's got the speed foam. It's got the speed pocket and all that good stuff and the kind of the the weight tuning in there. And it's that hollow body construction, so it does feel nice, but it does give it that extra oomph and that zip that you need. So let's hit a few more. 123 ball speed, that's not super fast at all. But let's just see if we can get this one. A few good shots of it. I'm using the new TaylorMade TP5X, which is going to be my new go-to ball if I can get some of them. Oh, yeah. I'm not trying to swing at this too fast. I'm just trying to get actually a nice group of shots. That one went nice. bit guidey but not too bad that one's gone a bit higher hasn't it yeah it's stopping okay four seven eight five not bad spin bit low Just drop me a comment if you are outraged by my low spin with a seven iron I wasn't to see now that's the great thing that was not hit good that was hit out the toe and it was hit low and it's still scampered up there yeah there's a bit of a drop off there that was the strike that's what I'm working on really getting onto your left side onto your left heel staying over it and coming through the shot that was a lovely strike right out of the middle yeah okay Nice. Let's just look at the uh, the numbers then. Okay, so let's take a look at the, the shots then. You've got some other things from previous videos there. Yeah, average ball speed, 124 of the 7 iron, which is nice. That's decent. That's kind of in the window that I'm happy with. Spin, 4766. That's spinning at, a, for me, I'm happy with that kind of rate because it's it's taking off at, I like the, the launch actually. It's taking off at 19 degrees, which for 7 iron, is exactly where I want to be for my 7.9. So I really like that. And it was pretty consistent. One that's slightly higher one that I did hit at 20 degree launch and a little bit lower as well. But generally okay. Love that. Um, peak height, 37. Yeah, again, high enough. So it's going to come in with a good descent angle of, uh, of 48. That's going to stop enough. Um, not super spinny, which is fine for what I'm looking for. Um, carrying at 182, which is a little short on average. I did hit a, a slightly heavy one, a couple of heavy ones. Um, so on the fairway, it, you're looking at kind of 190, 195 down the fairway on the green. I guess I'm looking at kind of 190 to the back, something like that, if I was going to the back of it. So it's nice. It feels nice. feels solid. 
decent spin numbers. I would suggest that anyone looking for, and it looks really kind of confident. It's a bit thick on the top line for me. I don't like it as much as, as my Mizuno Pro 225s. Um, I'll try and show you. It's, it is a bit thick on the top line. You look at that. A little bit thick. But um, yeah, other than that, it's a good club. It feels, I think it feels nicer than my Mizuno, potentially. Certainly on a miss hit, it feels nicer. Um, and now you can, I mean, you don't have to get the brand new ones, but they're not super expensive for irons. Some irons, like those Mizunos, are well over £1,000. These are not too bad. They're less than that. So I think they're a real bargain. Now, if you wait until the end to find out about how you can win this club, all you need to do is like the video and it's the usual stuff. Like it, subscribe, and then put a comment saying, pick me. What I will say, I'm really sorry, but if you're not in the United Kingdom, then I can't send it to you because it will just cost me a billion pounds. Not quite that much, but it will cost me a lot, more than it costs for the club, to be honest. So I can't spend loads of money on postage. I'm happy to give it away and happy to spend a few pounds on shipping within the country. So all you need to do, if you want to have this so that you can try it um, just be aware also it is a it is a demo club so it's got kind of the, the loft setting thing on there um, you might not want like if you're thinking of it as a replacement you might not want that on there so just full disclosure that's what what it is that you're winning uh, just like subscribe comment pick me and then I will pick now the key is I'm going to need one or the other of these two things for this to become valid either we need to get to what should we say 250 likes or i need to get to a thousand subscribers one or the other okay a thousand subscribers from where i'm at, at the moment that's quite a lot that would be another 500 subscribers you guys have to do a lot of liking and sharing and commenting to get it up to that uh but 250 likes that's not that's got to be relatively easy right 250 likes if everyone that watches it likes it easily get 250 likes okay so that's all we need we need 250 likes or a thousand subscribers you need to like it you need to subscribe yourself and you need to comment saying pick me all right and then i will randomly pick it so there we go thanks very much for watching guys i'm knackered I'm, this is like the sixth video i've recorded today i'm hot in here i've had enough um if you're still watching you haven't subscribed and you're not doing the competition or whatever please consider subscribing i love you forever thanks for watching guys